Happy put some more Skyrim. Um, last episode, I don't remember where we left off at all. It has been, like, what, a week now? A week or so? Um. Yeah, so it's been, it's been a while. I need to go charge my phone. But anyways, it's been, it has been a couple of days. I'm going to be doing Skyrim every Saturday. I know it's a little bit late. I'd help my friend move this weekend, so I didn't really get a chance to stream. So I've been trying to catch up with videos. Um, so with that being said, where the hell do we leave off? I really don't remember. Speak to the graybeards. Where are we? That's a cliff. If I ever saw one. Um, hmm. Okay. How the fuck did I get here? And why would I want to be up here? Alright, well, this is the only safe way down, I'm guessing. So, I'm going to get back on the main road, and I'm just going to follow it. And there we go. We're just going to do that. Hello, Lydia. Yes, I know, you will never leave me now. Which is... Quite alright. I think she can... Even if she's married, she'll still follow me anyway. That is a big cat. Hello. You do have good stuff. I'll take that. Alright. <clears throat> so we're just going to keep moving on. Um. Yeah, so last episode, I'm pretty sure I just went off on a little tangent and went off up the wrong mountain, wrong pathway, and been exploring, yada, yada, yada. Wasn't supposed to go that way, now we know. So now we're going this way. Uh, hopefully we're going the right way. I am just following the map. Why do I have two objectives? Oh, it was really like, it was really like on the edge of uh, it being on either side. But I love it. But yeah, we're just going to follow this road up here, get to wherever we're going. Go we'll talk to the Greybeards. This episode is hopefully what we'll be doing. Hopefully we don't get sidetracked. Hopefully we don't get attacked by anything. Die. Yada, yada, yada. Um, yeah, so I, I appreciate you guys' support a lot. Uh, I'm surprised the Home Sweet Home video has actually gotten a lot more views than I expected it to, to be honest. Uh, I like the comments on it, though. Really, really helpful. You guys are doing great with the support. I really appreciate it. There's another goddamn cat. Could you stop? <laughs> Thank you. Alright. Give me your stuff. I'll actually eat that one. Restore stamina coming from eating the saber cat tooth. That's a little weird. It's a little uh, odd, to be honest, that you'd eat a saber tooth paw. But I, I don't judge. You eat what you want to eat. Be it vegan, non vegan, definitely not edible, but you know, whatever. You eat your food, eat your meats, eat your. Tooth, whatever the tooth, tooth made out of, like calcium, like bone, yeah, whatever, whatever. You eat, you eat, you eat your teeth, I guess. You chew with your chewers. Hey, coyote or not coyotes, fucking wolves. Attack me! Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay, Lydia, can you let me attack a little bit, please? This is why I think I'm gonna send you home if I can. Eventually, I will send you home. So I can start adventuring on my own and getting more experience with my kills. Because you keep killing everything. You need to stop. Alright, you're a coyote. Fox type thing. Fuck you. Whatever. It's, it's a fox, not a coyote. They don't have coyotes in this game. Yo, I missed. Alright, that's a pathway if I ever saw one. How are these... Freaking, this is a steep ass. Still, I mean, if I was a and I'd carry like thousands of pounds of shit up the mountains, would I do it? Probably I'm a horse, but still, like, goddamn, that's rough. Ooh, iron. Yeah, money, big money, iron. Could give me some iron. So, iron won't necessarily. Really? What the hell? Did my pickaxe break? Did he really just break on me? 
look down at my phone for two seconds. I don't need a bucket. I'll try to have so much money now. I don't have to really worry about stuff like that. Bree's home. I have the key to her house. Why? I don't remember. What the? Uh, actually, just do all. No. All. Do, 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 do. Pickaxe. No, you didn't break. This isn't empty. Alright, whatever. Alright, pickaxe is broken. Snap leg cave. Yeah, let's not go in there. I feel like that's gonna happen to me. I'm gonna die horribly. I'm okay though. God, it's beautiful. With the Aurora Borealis. I wish I could go see that. I really do. That seems really like a beautiful natural sight I really would love to go see. Uh, I think you could see it maybe in like what? I doubt you for sure can hell see it in Alaska, but can you see it anywhere else? Hello. Is that your cart? With the old barrel? Why did you just sit down? Dude, you were just standing up. Thank you for the salt. Are, Are you okay? Are you okay? Bandits attacked and ransacked my cart. Can you help me? No. You couldn't afford my time. My camp is nearby in the ruins of Nilheim. Get me there safely, and you'll be rewarded. Okie dokie. This guy seems trustworthy. It's just across the bridge right? and up that hill. Okay. Um, it's weird though that you were just fine like two seconds and then you're automatically saying you got attacked. I didn't see you get attacked, but whatever. We're close now. I can see the camp. Oh, I can you? I know what this guy's story is. Wait. Need something? <laughs> Don't do that. Oh no! Give me the gold, Give me the arrows. How's my other bow actually? Get rid of this. I does ten. I could already upgrade the other one. Fuck it, we're taking that. Yeah, we're putting that one in. Yeah, you get them, Lydia. These guys are bad. Why would we lead them to a bandit camp? Doesn't make much sense to me. Oh well, he's dead though, so, you know. Yeah, okay, yeah, so I knew he was going to be a bad guy. Because it's, it's, it's honestly really obvious. And as a kid, when I played this part, I was always like, Oh, I'm going to help him out. I'm a good guy. And then he attacked me like, Oh, you son of a bitch. Now I just kill him every time now. Because he doesn't deserve my sympathy. Ooh, seared slaughterfish. That sounds like a really cool animal. Ooh, leather strips. I'll take those. Search barrel. Dude, carry that. Slaughterfish gills or scales no you won't no are you attacking me oh look at that you missed nice miss bud i'll take that lock though okay have a good time all right church pot carry snowberries i didn't mean to sit at the table but that's fine now i gotta wait for the animation to stop Sack is empty, that's empty. I didn't mean to take that, god damn it. Well, now this camp is free for everybody to take. Literally what they want out of it, so that being said, I'm I'm dropping one of those though. I'm gonna keep that. That seems useful to me. That's a thirteen damage bow. Uh, it's also, I'm in favor of that shit. I don't need two of those though. Imperial bow, you can go drop yourself. And. 
Let's do Warhammer. It's 22. Okay. That's not bad at all. That is empty. I already explored that. Uh, again, I am getting to sidetracked again. I'm sorry. But, oh well. Chop wood. Let's get some wood chopping. Why? I don't know. Hey. Yeah. Alright, that's good enough. Because now I'm carrying too much wood. Oh, we have food. Ale. This. Can I cook in your camp? I can't. There's no cook thing. Alright. Okay. You got a lockpick though, so I wonder if there's a chest around here. What is this? It's just a building. I think that's where I need to go. Someone there? I can do Yeah, we're knock knock. Jehovah's Witness. Uh, your friend tried to kill me. I just, he said he had a prize. I was just gonna collect that. Thank you. I don't know how I killed you, but... I mean, sure, it works, I guess. Thanks for that. I'll take that. I'll take a coin purse. This is 15 damage. What does my weapon now do? Eighteen. Uh, it's not that good. Technically, we should probably sleep a little bit. Yeah, let's sleep. Let's go to sleep. All right. We'll sleep until six in the morning, like I did this morning. All right, we're all rested. Good job, Lydia. You're really doing good on this adventure. Aren't you proud that you went with me? Probably not. You probably want to go home and sleep. I tried to send you home so, you know, you could rest, but... No, no, no. You wanted to come with. I'm going to complain about the whole adventure. Being long, arduous, and boring. With no... No joy for you. No joy for her. Okay, apparently I didn't need that lockpick, but whatever. Ooh... Shit, I'll take it. Two. Lydia, come here. I need your skills with your backpack. I've got your back. Of course. Let me check your backpack. I don't need that stuff now. So we are good. Let's get out of here. Should probably head down the main road. Anyways, I mean I could easily just cut through here. And skip part of the adventure of going all the way around. Fuck it. I just fell off, so now we're going this way anyways. I didn't want to fall off. I wanted to actually go down the long way. Did I actually get tossed under into the rapids? Oh yeah, well, okay, cool. We are here of our own accord. I can swim underwater here, can I? <clears throat> kind of. Wait, I don't, oh, that's right. I don't have to worry about not breathing. I can swim underwater. Honestly, this is pretty iffy. Probably just gonna swim to. I'm not underwater enough. Alright. Clear deposit. I don't really want to mine that, though. No. So I don't necessarily have. I do have the. What does clay give me? Not sure clay sounds like hard rock but I mean whatever because clay is more like a muddy mushiness that you can mash in your hands and form into a houses
How long of this can I go? I don't think that ends. I think that's a never ending source of uh, clay materials. So we're just going to ignore that for now. How full is it? 275. That's not too bad. Ooh, a barrow. Literally right next to a city. That's smart. Alright. Lydia, it's currently 747. It's time for a drink. Welcome to the Villamere Inn. If there's anything I can get you, just let me know. <laughs> can I get a whiskey? These Probably don't have that. These bears Ugh. are driving me crazy. This has to be the oh, worst yeah, place in Skyrim to run a mill. How am I supposed to do anything with all those bears running around? You Are have you a bear kidding? problem? Those I'm guessing. Those damn things will drive me right out of business. Tell you what, bring me ten of their pelts from anywhere in Skyrim. I'll gladly pay you for thinning out the. Okay. Honest gold for honest work. Have you ever seen what a bear does to the trees? They jump on their hind legs and scratch them to bits, marking their territory or something. It's getting to the point where I have to scour Skyrim for untouched trees at the right size. Cost me too much time and money. The beards stay away from me and I stay away from them. Suits me just fine. Aren't you just a peachy person in My the morning? My business is falling apart. My apprentice never listens to me, and now there's talk of dragons. I suppose if I hadn't fault. sunk every bit of gold I had into my mill, I would have picked up and left Iverstead long ago. Mm hmm. Is it absolutely necessary for you to bother me right now? You don't look like Actually, a yes. pilgrim. Why bother visiting Iverstead? Because you have a really shifty Clinic eyeball thing going food supplies on. up to them once every few weeks, when the weather permits it. Other than that, they seem like a quiet lot. Don't really know too much about them. <sighs> what a boring conversation. Oh, Harder I could me, totally though. do it, but huh? I'm a good guy. Sorry. If you fancy a bit of music, let me know. Um... I play the loop. What do you play? If you'd like to hear something, it only costs five gold. I'll tell you. That's expensive. Why, thank you. You're very kind. Still interested? No. You should follow your heart. Thank you, my lord. Perhaps one, but not today. There's nothing like a good song to lift the spirit in troubled times. Yes, we have traveled very far, or I killed a man either innocent or not trying to kill me with his bandit camp so probably not innocent all right well she's if playing I her lovely drink for the thirsty, you got for sale? food for the hungry my mind switched those two by the way i thought he said food for the thirsty drink for the hungry and i've been like ah oh, cool makes sense perfect sense love it okay ingredients garlic snowberries what do you got Okay. I could buy all this food and then sell it back to him. Well, that would serve no purpose. We don't get purpose. many visits. The Greybeards are a solitary lot. <coughs> I don't think they've ever ventured outside their monastery. We oh, get the not. occasional pilgrim passing through here on their way to the summit, but almost all of them have returned disappointed. Why? There ain't much more to tell. They're haunted, and you should stay away. Look, I've seen one of the spirits with my very own eyes. When it glared at me, I swear it burned right through my soul. Ah, oh, you're such a big Fortunately, baby. Fortunately, they seem to be sticking to the barrow. I think they're guarding it. Certainly isn't helping my business any. Who'd want to rent a room anywhere near a haunted barrow? Surprisingly, a lot of people would. If you think there's anything you can do, be my guest. Yes, yeah, send an unknown civilian, civilian into a quote-unquote haunted bar. Yeah, it's a good idea. Perfect plan. About a year or two ago, 
Some fella named Windelius came through. Said he was some kind of a treasure hunter. I warned yeah. him not to go in there, just like I warned you. The very and next did he night listen? we heard screams from the barrel, and that was it. Oh, we no. never saw him again. Was well, it screaming that gave it away? I heard tell of a lad in Windhelm, Aventus Aretino. They say he's been doing the Black Sacrament, trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. Damn fool. Okay, well that's a season, whatever Sir, season I want to do for I've got that. no interest in magic users. No use for their kind at all. They're way up north in Winterhold, and that's fine with me. I don't even something. like our Jarl having a court wizard. That's kind of dumb. If you dumb. pass through again, stop by for a drink. Negative. All right, uh, McHorn's booby uh, skirt boots, ready to go. All right, let's go. And the only reason I said that was because that suit of armor really accentuates it, which is really awkward for me because I, she looks really dumb with her. What the fuck? Hello? Yeah, you. Hello. Um, I'm gonna go talk to him. I'm gonna go talk to this crazy guy. Yep. yep. Hi. I thought it was a naked person. <laughs> okay, I'm glad you aren't. Can't see Hello, you, Narfi. Can't find you. Why are you hiding? Hide, hide, hide. Don't make me sad. Uh, yep. You're crazy. Um, here, are you okay? Gone. Went to gather plants and never came home. Nope, nope. Everyone looked and no one could find her. Wilhelm said she'll be back. Told Harvey not to worry. Rada will come back. With father, I said goodbye. With mother, I said goodbye. Rada leaves and Narvi can't say goodbye. Makes Narvi very, very sad. Narvi needs Rada to say goodbye. Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. Rada. I'll go talk. Rada. All right, I'm gonna go talk to Raider. This guy seems really important, like, like end game level important. I'm gonna go do it, just because why not? And fuck you, and it'll be funny. I think it'll be really funny. I, I'm personally, I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna go talk to Raider. I gotta go find Wilm Wilmhelm. So let's go look for him. Hello, Wilmhelm. There is a man singing about radars. Who is he? Is your name? Joff Thor. My daughter's driving me crazy. So forgive me if I'm a bit on it. They call it the path to the Monastery to Seven Deaths. Can mm -hmm. you imagine? I'm not certain no. if I could even make it to the top without collapsing from exhaustion. Oh. Just get it's out of town as huh? fast as you can. Nothing for anyone here. That's kind of a dick thing. I'm going to harvest these for you. Oh, I'm going to help you guys out with your farming. You must have so much to yeah. tell about the world outside this Oh, town. good lord. No, I don't. Sorry. Please don't ever look at me again. Fuck. You're a gorgeous human being. There's a chicken. <laughs> Why are you coughing? Are you sick? Lydia, you better not be sick. You better not get me sick. If you get me a cold or something... Before the wedding, I'm gonna be pissed. And I don't mean our wedding. I mean, real life. you get me sick. You guys are not very happy people, huh? All dicks. That town's a bunch of jackasses and dickboards. Let's keep making leather. I made too many leather strips. I made one leather strip on accident. That's fine. Okay. Now, um. You're not the guy I was looking for, so I'm gonna just... By the gods, it's true. Are you it? Wilhelm? A dragon has attacked White Rock. How could me and yes. bring down such a piece? Uh, with our weapons? If you ever settle down to have children, think twice before you do it. Okay. You're getting pushed, dude. Oh, wait, wait, stop. Alright, is he in the... Is Wilhelm the guy I just talked to in the bar? She sounds familiar. Or is he a Jarl? Or where where would the Jarl be? This place doesn't look like it has a palace or anything. Well, sorry, I know this. Would... Yeah, I was right. Okay, this is the dude. We don't get yes, many visitors um... through here. 
Uh, What's the story with Narfi? He's been in a state ever since his sister Raida disappeared over a year ago. He just keeps to himself in what's left of his folks' farmhouse across the river. I just said that to make the poor guy feel better. I'm pretty sure she's dead. Raider would gather oh ingredients from the small island in the river east of here. Then one day, she just vanished. I tried to look for go. her, but she never turned up. Just like you didn't look in the thing? I've seen some sort of a cave entrance over there. Folks call it Geierman's Hall. But I don't know why. Probably best if you avoid it for now. It didn't seem to do Raida any good. I, 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 I'm, I'm interested in this. I'm doing it. Fuck it. I know we're, I know we're getting sidetracked with side quests. But you know what? We walked all the way over here. We saw an old naked... Uh, you'd be a naked guy. Standing, staring at me. Fuck. Okay, I am... Where's the map at? Nope, that's skills. God damn it. Map. There you go. Down there. Alright. We are going to be doing... Where's that side quest at? Miscellaneous. I want to locate... Yeah, I want to look at her remains. Let's do that. Alright. Um, yeah, so we're going to go do this for now. Because why not? And then we'll... If we want to, then we can go do whatever. And yada, 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 yada. What does the Dragonborn do once he's summoned by the Greybeards? Can the Thune be taught like any skin? Uh, yeah, it's a video game, but they have to. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no! Is that her? Fucking water? Jesus, how am I supposed to do this without the water? No! Good lord, okay. Uh, ah, fuck, I can't adjust properly. Alright. I am so sorry. She didn't make it anywhere, because she literally drowned, like, 20 feet from shore. Not even 20 feet. Like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, whatever. She she didn't make it very far. I thought I was supposed to look for a cave. I didn't even look at the cave. I just fucking... Okay. Wow. <laughs> she drowned under... I'm laughing, but I'm also kind of just surprised at uh, how how fast that quest was, and uh, how really it's terribly sad that it must be for you. Oh, Raider, Raider, you live among the clouds now, dear Raider. <laughs> she said she'll be home soon. Oh, I could totally be an ass about it. Ah, uh, shit. Maybe I shouldn't. Raida, I'm gonna be nice. You saw me. Raida? Did you tell her Narfi cries? Did you tell her Narfi never said goodbye like mother and father? I want to lie to him because I want to make him feel happy, but no, I'm gonna tell him. I'm sorry, you just died. Oh God. I'm oh sorry. no. 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 Narfi never got to say goodbye. Now Narfi's all alone. I'm so At least sorry, Narfi, Narfi has raid his necklace. Reminds Narfi of his sister. Thank you for giving this to Narfi. Sorry, buddy. Ah, I'm so Narfi's sorry. Narfi's sad now. Still wait for Raida. No more sleep. No, no, no. Bro, she's Narfi's dead, though. Narfi's sad now. Still... All right, well, I thought that would have fixed him from his stupor, but uh, apparently I just made it worse. Because now he doesn't want to sleep. Uh, all right, let's no let's go sleep. let's go talk to the Gravebeards no, no, no. at this point. No, you don't you don't sleep no more, bud. Maybe you'll see your sister real like quick me, eh? with that attitude. Yeah, wait a minute. I was gonna laugh if he said that with a two-handed weapon, but no, I do like two-handed weapons. I prefer them actually. I would love to use a two-handed weapon, but I'm using this because I never actually really use these On that well. To and I wanna steps again, Clinic? Not today. I'm just not ready to make the climb to High Hrothgar. The path isn't safe. Aren't the great beards expecting some supplies? Yeah, Honestly, they're gonna starve. I'm not certain. I've yet to be allowed into the monastery. Perhaps one day. 
I How can I talk through to you? on your way to High Hrothgar? About to make a delivery up there myself. Why should he want I've been to the it? monastery many times, but I've never even laid eyes on beards. Not that I'd care. Being you masters care. of Thuum, they could kill you by uttering a single word. Well, <laughs> not that Easy. they would. They seem peaceful, but I wouldn't want to provoke them. <coughs> Mostly food supplies like dried fish and salted meats. You know, things that keep fresh for a long time. The Greybeards tend not to get out much, if you catch my meaning. Okay, well, it's kind of an understanding between us. I mean, it just wouldn't feel right to charge them for a bit of preserved food. Trouble is, <coughs> my legs aren't what they used to be, and climbing the 7,000 steps takes its toll. Hey, well that would be kind of you. I'm heading Here, up there anyways, might as well do it and get another supplies. question done. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside, and you're done. Copy that, that sounds fun. Well, there's the occasional wolf pack <coughs> or stray, but that's all I've ever had to deal with. Shouldn't be a problem for the like you. Other than that, okay. watch your footing. In these wintry conditions, the stairs can be treacherous. Be careful up Ooh, there. Oh, thank you. Will do. All right, Lydia, let's go talk to the voices. The masters of the Thum. <clears throat> what, what's this? Read etch table. Emblem 1. Before the birth of men, the dragons ruled all of Mun all Mundus. Their word was the voice, and they spoke only for true needs. For the voice could blot out the sky and flood the land. Okay, that's pretty powerful. Um. You okay, goat? Did you just go mountain and die? Never drop though, so you... Hey, I just ran him right off the fall, and he just fell to his death. Ooh, wolves. More kills. It's a wolf, Lydia. Victory for never. It's dead. It's not going to get back. We're not playing Shadow of Mordor. We're fine. Let's got to play again. I want to stream. But yeah, um... We're just going to make our way up the thousand steps. I really hope that was just an exaggeration. I probably could have counted these, but I don't know if this counts as a step or not. And then it just gets really confusing. Like, is each step, like, three steps one considered one step or, or what? Oh, hey. Look for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Hrothgar. Did you hear the Greybeards call Dovaki? I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. It means Dovakin. I like to spend time up here. Walk the steps. Meditate on the emblems. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. They're not the sort to take visitors. But I never go that high up the path anyway. Some Why not? folk who make the trip leave them food or other essentials, but not to make conversation. Good day. Okay. I'm, I'm just going to read your uh, Etzteller, Elm 2. Men were born and spread over the face of Mundus. The dragons presided over the crawling masses. Men were weak then and had no voice. Interesting. Ooh, it's raining. Well, now it's snowing a little bit. Got the chills in this room because the fan's on. And it's actually kind of cold in here, which is really working well for the atmosphere of the game. Because here. Hey, wolf. Attack. And, oh, you took you're taking more hits than I thought you would. Yeah, well, it's a wolf, Lydia. Again, they're not. They're smart animals, but they're not super smart. They're not like. They pack. They, they hunt in packs. And my mind was going to say, we pack, they pack in hunts. Which makes perfect sense. Because I am not an intelligent animal. As you can tell. Uh. Ow. I would like a wolf as a dog. 
but I know I can't really have one because this game would not let me. Maybe it would, I don't know. Also, I like Lydia's little comments. She's like, well, there goes another one, I guess. She doesn't seem very enthusiastic. She's not like, there they are, let's get them. Oh, there's a wolf. Okay, we might want to run away. What the fuck? That is new. When has that been there? That's never been there, has it? Emblem 3, the fledgling spirits of men were strong in old times, unafraid to war with dragons and their voices. But the dragons only shouted them down and broke their hearts. Yeah. Moonforge discovered. What the hell is this? Is this part of that... One of the things I did? Oh! This is all for, uh... The Lord of the Rings stuff. Wait, do I not have this? Silver ingot. Oh, son of a bitch. Wait, Lydia. Wait, hang on, hang on. Hold on. Fuck, that doesn't have anything. Lydia, we're getting attacked. Watch out. Now that's how it's done. Just right him back. Hey, do you have a steel ingot on you, by I the way? My old friend. Uh, let me, I would like to say some you? things with you. Give me that steel ingot uh, that I gave you. I swear I gave you one, right? Fuck, no I didn't. Very good. Uh, is there nothing else in here? Shards of Narsil. Oh, it's so cool. Oh, but it takes an hour and it takes two hours. That doesn't really seem to be what I need. I need steel. Damn it. Alright, can I upgrade this though? My weapons? Let's see if I can do that. Balmer bow. Fourteen. Crap that. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Alright, everything's upgraded just a little bit more. There's no armor area so that's fine i guess let's just keep moving that's cool though at least i know where that's at so that's for another um bot i have that i forgot i had forgot i had which allows me to uh forge lord of the rings weapons which i may very well do later on in the game figure out where they are where that stuff is at um let's keep going I'm hoping I'm not missing these tablets, though. Uh, so I read three of them so far. We are high up in the mountains, though. What is over there? What is that? Looks like a tower over there. I don't remember being, there being so many mountains over here. Maybe there wasn't, I just never really paid attention to it. Weird. Hello. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Rothgar. Yep. So I was just outside so Iverstead when it happened. It's an exciting moment. Nothing like this has happened in centuries. Oh, just a okay. pity. Pretty significant. I'd prefer to leave it at that, if you don't mind. Walking the steps. Meditating on the emblems. I make this trip every few years. Nice. All right, Good then. for you. I'm reading the emblem. Alright. Kain called on Parthenax, who pitied man. Together they men to use the voice. Then dragon... Dragon wolf. Dragon against Tom. So Parthenax taught men how to read. Wait a minute. Yeah? Wait a second. 
called on Parthenax who pitied man. Together they taught men to use the voice. That doesn't sound like he's like a human. Otherwise, because humans didn't know how to do the voice. And only dragons know how to do the voice. So does that mean a dragon pitied man and helped them? Oh, this doesn't look weird. Hey, look at that! It's naked butt cheeks. What is that, a troll? Hey, troll, get down from there. You're gonna hurt yourself. Come on, but oh, 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 ooh! Okay, that actually a lot there. Save your life, Lydia. You okay, though? Yeah, you're okay. What's this say? Mum five. Men prevailed, shouting Alduin out of the world, proving that for all that their voice was too that their voice too was strong, although those sacrifices were many fold. I would die because they all literally just made it like Literally fought dragons who could turn the sky black and and the literal world. And they somehow won, which is cool, they're great. Good, good for us. Yeah. Now. Oh, it's fun that we gotta go on this I'm tired, sorry. I'm probably gonna pass up a cup of coffee before I keep going. Yeah. Okay, that's, that's, that looked weird. I, I wasn't sure what that was. It looks like a path, but it's not really a path. It just ends. This last tablet? With roaring tongues, the sky children conquer, founding the first empire with sword and voice, whilst the dragons withdrew from this world. Okay, cool. I, uh... I didn't know you could read these, actually. So... It's really, uh, it's really interesting you could actually read these. I totally glossed over these things when I was younger. I don't know why I would've. It looks like they had stuff on them. Uh, the tongues at Red Mountain went away humbled. Jurgen Windcaller called his seven-year meditation. How, understand how strong voices could fail. And thus he realized that if you shout, you lose your voice. Because your horse, your your white, your throat gets hoarse, and then you die, and there you go. But let's see what this says. Emblem seven or eight. I don't fucking remember anymore. Fuck it. Jerk and wind collar chose silence and return. The seventeen disputants could not shout him down. Surgeon, Surgeon the Calm built his home on the throat of the world. Okay. Which is this... Mountain, right? That's really windy up here, actually. I, I call an Argonian who's a, I think he's a cold-blooded reptile, is uh, I'm in a bit of an issue with the cold. <clears throat> For years, all silent, the Greybeard spoke no name, spoke one name. Tiber Septim Stripling then was summoned to Rothgar. They blessed and named him Dovakin. Oh, so Tiber Septim was a, uh, was a. Uh, before, like the guy said. And the voice is worship, follow the inner path, speak only in true need. Ooh, the sky added. What is that? What does that do? Hang on. Magic. Uh active effects. Animals will need more from you. Three hours. I have this perk.
I just, I'm stealing your food. You guys don't seem to need it anyways. You guys are, you guys are AI. You don't really need food. I, I need food though. Alright. Nobody judge me. Here. Actually, I feel bad for you. So this is what I'm gonna do. You guys. Food I was supposed to drop off. There it is. Yes, do that. Alright, there you go. Boop. I have to go talk to Clement. I'll do it after this. That's cool though, I found the, uh, the moon... What's it called? Moon shrine? Moon... Stone? Moon forge? Oh shit, hello. Uh... Oh good, you're all... So, a dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. Hello. We will see if you truly have the gift. Show us, okay. Dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. I'm not doing that. No, I'm not kissing you, weirdo. All right, there you go. Shout you want me to use my shout? Let us taste of your voice. At you? Uh. Okay. Uh. Strike you're us an with idiot. The power of your voice. I'm stowing it. You listen. You're an idiot. You're mean. Fuck you. Boosh! There you go. How does that feel? Dragonborn. Huh? It is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. Yeah. Whatever, man. I am Master. Want me to yell at you? Now I'm yelling at you. I speak for the Greybeards. Sorry. No, I'll probably stop doing that. So you guys won't have me yelling in my mic at your you ears. If you're watching this at home while you're trying to sleep or something, I do apologize. I just yelled at you for no reason. Uh, who's Day this place? Beans, followers of the way of the voice. Followers of in the, the way of the voice. Of Here we commune with the voice of the soul to achieve balance between our inner and outer selves. Okay. Here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first <clears throat> bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether okay. you are the only dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the that has been revealed thus far. That is all I can say. You could say that, that there was just, I'm the only one that's... I'm answering your summons, master. Uh, I'll be welcome a dragon boy, Hrothgar. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in fulfillment of your destiny. What is my destiny? And we don't mean destiny to- For you to discover. We can show you the way, but not your destination. You have I'm shown ready. Dragonborn. You have the Dragonborn gift. But, do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Okay. Our training have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum, a shout. Now let us see if you are willing really able to learn. When you shout in the language of dragons, thus your dread gives you an inborn ability to learn the words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, the second word in unrelenting force. I'm ready. Ro, teach me. balance in the dragon tongue. Combine it with Fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharply. Ro. Did he whisper it though? That's pretty cool. Ro. I'm gonna Ro. Word of power learn, balance, unrelenting force. But learning a word of power is only the first one. Okay. Sorry, I couldn't hear you with the music. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. 
As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge claim. As part of your initiation, Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding of Rome. Wait, so I'm able to steal the souls of dragons? Sorry, the wind was in my ears. I couldn't hear you. Shouts. I know you boys are ready. Who am I shouting at? Am I shouting at you? Use your unrelenting force shout to strike the targets as they appear. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> I was gonna do it on the guy, and that probably would have caused him to get hit. Bro. Sorry, Einarth, I didn't mean to hit you, dude. I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to hit these. I'll, I'll, I'll get them back up. I'm sorry. I promise. Um, I am. It's well, not letting me. Again. I knocked down your, your pots. I'm sorry. I feel bad. Ah! Lydia, no! Lydia, move! God damn it, Lydia! Force! No! Lydia. Still here. I need you to do All something. Alright, what is it? What's wrong? What do you need? Go wait over there. Go, Anything go, else? Just go over there. Go, ah! Fucking move, you idiot! God damn it. Alright, I'm on I, I don't wanna knock those spots over, I'm sorry. Uh, Lydia, you might wanna move. Force! Wanna... No! Impressive. I'm sorry I yelled at you, okay? You show great promise, Dragon. Thank you. We will perform mm, your next I... trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Boy. Master Bori. <laughs> Alright, let's go, Bori. You're very boring. Ha, I got him! Oh! Shots fired. Sorry, that was rude. Seriously, though, bro. Uh. This is a cool place. It doesn't seem that big, though. But it sure is. Oh, look, cool. Aren't you guys cold though? You're literally in a stone tower where it's cold. I'm right behind you. Of course. How are you liking the adventure or something? Maybe you can help me. Yes, my thing. That is a lot. That's a lot of shit I didn't read. We'll, we'll do it later. We will now we'll figure it out later. You learn a completely new shot. Master okay. Boy will teach you Wult, which means Wult. You must hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thumb. This is one of the word. Okay, no, so I was going to relax. Sorry, the music's really loud. I can't hear you! The wind is really loud! What did you say? Now we will see how quickly you can master a new shot. I'm trying to lean into my own headset to hear what he says. The, fucking, the wind is so loud. Then it will be your turn. Master Bori. I'm sure I have to put X. Wolf. Attack. Now it's your turn. And he immediately flies Stand off the map. next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. I'm ready. Alright, I did mastery it. mastery of a new thume is uh, astonishing. I'd heard Thank the you. stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself.
You were given this gift by the gods for a reason. It is up to you to determine how best to use it. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jürgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengraf. Remain okay. true to the way of the voice, and you will return. I have a lot of questions for you. Holy shit, I do have a lot of questions. All right. Why are the dragons returning? Does it have something to do with me? Am I really the one causing all no of this doubt. shit to happen to everybody else? The appearance else? of a dragon born at this time oh, is good. not an accident. Your destiny is surely bound up with the return of the dragons. You should focus on honing your voice, and soon your path will be made clear. Hey, I didn't he kneel on the ground. Is his, are his knees hurting? Is he okay? Good. Then you will be ready for whatever lies ahead. Thank you. Okay, I can just keep, no, I can you should one focus again. on honing. Yeah. Dragons have the inborn ability to learn and project their voice. Dragons also are able to absorb the power of their slain brethren. A few oh, mortals so dragons are born their with own brothers. Abilities, whether a gift or and a sisters. curse has been a matter of debate down through the centuries. What you have already learned in a few days took even the most gifted of us years to achieve. Some believe that Dragonborn are sent into the world by the gods at times of great need. We will hmm. speak more of that later, when you are ready. Okay, sounds good enough. Uh, what are the shouts of the Dragonborn? always been able to shout. Language is intrinsic to their very being. There is no difference in the dragon tongue between debating and fighting. Shouting comes as naturally to a dragon as breathing or speaking. In mythic times, when mortal kind was in great need, the goddess Kinnereth granted us the ability to speak as dragons do. For most people, long years of training are required to learn even the simplest shout. But for you, the dragon speech is in your blood, and you learn it almost without effort. That's good. Five. Our leader, Parthenax lives alone on the peak of the throat of the world. When your Why voice can alone? open the path, you will know you are ready to speak to him. Okay. As I said, you will know you are ready when your voice can open the path to him. Okay. Why does he live alone, though? We study the way of the voice according to the teachings of our founder, Jürgen Windcaller. Very few are permitted to study with us here at High Hrothgar. But right, in that's... your case, Dragonborn, it is a privilege to guide you towards mastery of your voice. He was a great war leader of the ancient Nords, a master of the voice. After the disaster at Red Mountain, where the Nord army was annihilated, he spent many years pondering the meaning of that terrible defeat. He finally came to realize that the gods had punished the Nords for their arrogant and blasphemous misuse of the voice. He was the first to understand that the voice should be used solely for the glory and worship of the gods, not the glory of men. Jürgen okay. Windcaller's mastery of the voice eventually overcame all opposition and the way of the voice was born. Tell we more study about the, the way of the voice. Very few are permitted yes, to here. But in your yeah. case, Dragonborn... Yeah, you already said this. Why don't the others talk? I do voices that. are too powerful for anyone not trained in the way to withstand. Even a whisper <clears throat> could kill you. Oh, good night. That's awesome. Let's talk to each other. The voice was a gift of the goddess Kinnereth. At the dawn of time, she gave mortals the ability to speak as dragons do. Although this gift has often been misused, the only true use of the voice is for the worship and glory of the gods. True mastery of the voice can only be achieved <clears throat> when your inner spirit is in harmony with your outward actions. In the contemplation of the sky, Kinnereth's domain and the practice of the voice we strive to achieve this balance. Okay, that's respectful. 
that is commendable. But remember, the dragon blood is itself a gift of Akatosh. Do not try to deny that gift. Your destiny okay. requires you to use your voice. Why else would Akatosh have bestowed this power upon you? If you remember to use your voice in service to the purpose of Akatosh, you will remain true to the way. The voice was a... Although the true master... In the contemplation of the sky, Kinnereth's domain... Okay, cool. And the practice of the voice, we strive to achieve this balance. Okay, cool. Alright, Lydia, let's stand over here, and we're going to end the episode over here. Come on. Come here. Oh gosh. Woo, that's high. Alright, okay, so anyways, thank you guys all so much for watching. Oh shit! Shit! Oh, uh, hey, oh. <laughs> okay. Alright, no, we're just gonna stand here. We're just not gonna move. Alright, so anyways, thank you guys all so much for watching. It's really loud, so I'm gonna pause it. I didn't do anything. Alright, but anyways, thank you guys all so much for watching the video. Hopefully you guys are liking it. If you guys are liking it, a great a light would be a like would greatly be appreciated um if you guys would like to see more videos that i've done maybe hit that subscribe button if you guys would like to uh that also help out a lot too uh it really shows me that i'm making progress on videos that you guys would like to see uh, if you guys would like to comment what i should like what you guys would like to see me do in in the in the videos stuff like that that'd be wonderful as well so anyways have a good rest of your day and i will see you guys later Bye bye everybody